Hey guys, Luke Product here doing another figure review, this time of something a little different. Transformers, Titans Return, Chrome Dome, and Autobot Style Lore. Before we get into anything else, let's quickly go over accessories. Chrome Dome and Style Lore come with a weird looking gun and a pistol. Now you can peg the pistol into the weird looking gun to form a sort of like turret for a Style Lore to sit in. And it kind of works. And you, also, you can also play, take it onto the side if you can fit it in somehow. No, you can't. You can't. You can't fit it in. I've, I've lost everything. Oh God! Everything's falling apart. No. And we're back. But yeah, as you can see, this is Stylor, a little headmaster of sorts for Chrome Dome. Got a little Chrome Dome head on the back. But yeah, Stylor's tiny, really tiny. Quickly, go, quickly going over articulation for Stylor. He's got arms, so you could put them on up, and he's got legs, so you could like sit and yeah, and do stuff. You can also put him inside Chrome Dome's vehicle mode if you could somehow figure out to open, ah, figure out how to open this. If you're doing that up right there, and you could have him. Oh, screw that up! God damn it! There you go. You have them sit inside, driving around. If you can... Yeah, you can have them sit inside, you actually see them in there. It actually lines up perfectly. So yeah, it rolls pretty nicely. And with that out of the way, let's quickly go into robot mode. Starting off, as you can see, I opened up his arms, like so. They're on a little hinge joint. There you go. Open the cockpit. Get Stylor out, sit him on over there, peg the cockpit back down over here, see the holes, peg them back in, there you go, quickly come around to the front, open his legs, fold him on out, line him up correctly, and then just close that on up, flip his feet up, there you go, like so, quickly Snap his legs open, get a good stance going. Bring the camera up a little bit. Flip everything around. Fold down his chest plate. And then come around to here. Fold his backpack in, make sure you hear that click. There we go. Flip out his hands, like so. There you go. And then the other one. Nice and ratcheted. And then you take Stylor. You, well, first of all, you get him to, into position. And then you break his legs, his kneecaps, and slam his head on in. Head on. There you go. And that is Chrome Dome. As you can see, he's really nice looking. He's got this really cool mouth plate and visor deal looking. And yeah, quickly go over articulation. He's got a nice ball joint in there, so you can move around just about anywhere. He's got a nice 90 degree bend in his arm. It's not the best, but it works. He's got a waist joint. You can turn, get a nice bend at his knee. Same over here. He's got a swivel joint in there too. And his head is on a ball joint, thanks to Stylors. Nice and wiggly. Move around. And yeah, Chrome Dome is pretty poseable. You get him into pretty decent poses. Quickly get his, give him his accessories. He got his little gun, give him his little pistol, fit that on in. And you could easily get him to any any kind of pose you want him to. You could get him to a nice wide bounce stance. Fold his waist that way. And Ooh, there you go. There is Chrome Dome. Pretty nice looking figure. I really like, I really like this Chrome Dome because for one, this is the only available Chrome Dome as of late that isn't like super expensive or third party. And it's got that nice IDW touch to him because I love IDW Chrome Dome. So quickly getting going over that, set him up back here. Get him all situated. And he also comes with this really cool collector card. See, he's got a nice art of Chrome Dome over here, name, 
Uh, tech specs, never seen that in a long time. He has strength, speed, and intelligence. He's really smart when he comes by, when he combines with Stylor. And with that out of the way, let's go get going to size comparisons. Now here's Chrome Dome next to his buddy, Brainstorm. The Voyager class version to be exact, back in 3 and 30. It's pretty big. Here he is next to another deluxe class figure, First Aid. Here he is next to another Voyager class figure, NK Convoy, otherwise known as Optimus Prime. So yeah, he sizes up pretty well with the others. Um, in my personal opinion, if you like the character, Chrome Dome, or really enjoy IDW, I say you pick him up. He's a nice addition to the, to the collection, or if you're like a Transformers fan in general, he's a really nice addition. I mean, I love Chrome Dome, so I'm being a little biased here, but you know, to each their own. Anyways, this is my review of Transformers Titans Returns Chrome Dome, and I'll see you in the next one. Let's get into a nice little pose before I end the video. See you in the next one. Take care. Hello darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again.